Many musicians call Tulsa home, and a special concert festival called Free Tulsa is going on right now downtown. Two News reporter Asia Vickers is live with what fans can expect. Asia? Well, Free Tulsa was supposed to be an alternative to D-Fest, but when D-Fest got canceled, that's when this event got kicked into high gear. <laughs> For many, the day to rock out is finally here. There's been a lot of uh, a lot of anxiety and stress making things happen in such a short amount of time. Many headliners have ties to Oklahoma, such as Johnny Polygon, who's now gaining success in Los Angeles. His video premiered three days ago on MTV. It started off around number 40 and is now part of the top 10. Organizers say it's just amazing timing that he's scheduled to play the event Saturday. Because, I mean, this is the place that made me, you know, made me the person I am, so I always got to pay homage, always. Organizers feel Polygon will be a big draw for crowds. Plus, it also gives him more exposure. For many fans, it's all about supporting the local independent music scene. It would have just been completely devastating if we lost Edgefest and Deepest and didn't have anything to replace. So this is, this is an amazing thing to have going. Those putting on the event are hoping for 5,000 people throughout the two-day event. And for those wondering about the name, no, it's not free, as in free to the public. It, the cost is not free, um, but I think it's well worth it. I think we figured it out. It's 12 cents a band. So if that's too much to handle, then that's fine. And organizers say they've had no sponsors, so all of this money has come out of their own pockets. And if it's successful, they may do it again next year. Live in downtown Asia Vickers, 2 News works for you.